And here's the one I wanted to see as I'm running out of batteries. Beautiful, but so beat up. Hey, what's up? Deke from Odd USA. We are outside Cincinnati, Ohio. Home of Skyline Chili in the Cincinnati Reds. Went to a game last night, pretty awesome stadium. We uh, stayed across the river last night at a tiny house. I have a tour of it on my other channel, RelaxJacks.com. But well, right near here, I want to show you guys this. Two river boats. One that looks close to being decommissioned. The other one is uh, dry dock and certainly not in great shape, but pretty interesting. So let's go check it out. You can kind of imagine what this river used to be like back in the day when boats like this one here were still raining supreme and tearing up and down the river. Side paddler here. Here's an old riverside industrial building and here behind it you can see the paddle of that riverboat the one that's on dry ground windows blown out rusty and need a paint kind of like the other one here but this one's still floating looks like this one had a head-on collision turns out as i got closer this isn't just a building it's an old floating barge also on land more windows blown out there's a front door there's people behind me on the main tugboat i don't want to go in these because i'll probably get in trouble cops called me for trespassing but here the window at the front door, it's almost like a supermarket door, is completely shattered and open. But that is a huge barge that looks like a big old industrial building. It's massive. I mean, that thing's probably 200 feet long or close to 150. The giveaway is a spray paint all over, no tugs, it says. But this thing definitely got in a collision. It's just all smashed up. These were old excursion boats. Maybe one of them still is. It's really a shame to see the condition they're in. And what a cool like uh, apartment complex or a house that main boat would be. The Bell of Cincinnati, the River Queen, and the Mark Twain. More windows blown out. Oh wow. Different gates, tickets, admission. This probably was the bathrooms, the floating HQ that these boats were docked to. Perhaps. Here's the hull of it. Really rusty. Look at the size of these ropes, those are awesome. I mean, here's comparison, here's my hand. Man, just a shame. The salvage in these would be pretty cool. Yeah, tickets and information ahead. And here's the one I wanted to see as I'm running out of batteries. Beautiful, but so beat up. Just completely stripped from the inside out. You know, there are probably seats and stuff in here at one point in time. Different holding chambers here. Nothing left. Just a rusty mess. All the ceiling panels, most of them are knocked out. Just absolute in a state of decay. Beautiful at the same time. Upper deck railings. Now they probably waited for the river to be high to just let these float up here to eventually let them, you know, when the water receded, stay on land because they're still tethered to one another, that main building to this boat. front of her. Old plywood looking staircase. Kind of flimsy. Cool old door. I'd love to repurpose a door like that. Just with the story that it came from an old tugboat outside of Cincinnati. Alright, these floors are rotting so you can be careful. But I'm walking through an abandoned riverboat. Kind of a trip. engine that's crazy 
just reeks of spilled motor oil in here. Again, I'm Deke for Odd USA. Please subscribe and check out the other videos we have. See you later. We're out of here before we get in trouble.